right, in this video we're gonna go over the Big Daddy diesel operation. First of all, you wanna check your oil and uh, your fluid levels. Check your pump level. Sight glass on the side of the pump right there. Do a walk around. It's your hydraulic tank, engine, relief valve. This is this your pressure switch to turn on and off the heater when it senses pressure. Relief switch right there, switch valve, primer. Right here you got uh, your water filter, water supply line, off on your water tank, on on your water tank, on on your antifreeze when you want to antifreeze it, shut off your water tank. Now you're drawing antifreeze. Now you're drawing water. To antifreeze the whole system. Lighting right there. This is our Big Daddy diesel hot water with 600 gallons of water. Two independent tanks to keep the sloshing down. And look at the whole setup. So you got 500 feet a half. It will power up to 700 feet a half. Hydraulically driven. Controls all in the back. Take a look at the size of the hydraulic motor on this hose reel. It's all over engineered for long life. Easy start valve on off on the on the uh, hose reels. These are in the off position. Ups in the on position. These valves need a little bit of uh, WD-40 sprayed in here because they do tighten up as they go. It's best German valves made. There's for that hose drill. This one has 300 feet of 3 8 right here. 500 feet of half right there. Beautiful setup. We're going to go ahead and run this. Chris can install a warthog nozzle on the half inch right here. We're going to go ahead and run this unit. Going to cinch that up. Not too overly tight, but you want to tighten it up. And I'll, I'll take it out and get it in the line. It's free spin out, right? Yeah. This one nice thing about the hydraulic system on this unit, it's free spin out. Uh, power out and power in. Okay, so what we've done with this unit, we've installed a 12 inch stinger to the nozzle. That's to make sure that it won't come back around at you in the pipe. That's essential. If you don't have one, make sure your rig's got it. Okay, we're going to take this nozzle, we're going to go ahead and insert it in a in our 12 inch pipe here. Yeah, make sure it's in far enough to get some grip. Now I'm going to have Chris fire up our uh, Big Daddy Turbo Diesel. So he's turning the key on. This unit comes with a, uh, this unit was ordered with. I better clarify that. It's a full light stand, turntable, adjustable on the angle on the turn. Uh, about as nice a turntable as I've seen with all the controls right on the, right on the unit itself. So that's, that's uh, over and above, usually extra, but if you like it, we got it. It is expensive, but uh, good things aren't cheap. And cheap things aren't good. All right, so Chris is uh, working on the startup there. He's pushing the button. Shows the RPM. I don't know how well that'll come out on the screen. We're gonna let this unit warm up just a little bit. This is the startup position. Easy start valve, hose drill off, hose drill off. This unit's also got the, the dual hydraulic control. This is 3 8 
Real half inch real. All right, so we're in the pipe. We're gonna go ahead and give this thing a little juice. We're gonna turn on the, <clears throat> the water flow. Turn on the uh, unit. We got a little spray going on there. A little rotation action. That's on idle. We're gonna go ahead and rev it up a little bit. There goes your hose. pulling itself out. Go ahead and bring that in. We'll show you how the hydraulics work. We'll shut the flow off. Shut the bypass valve off. Shut the hose drill valve off. That's great. Compared to the other 18 at fours on the market, there's just no comparison. a big unit and it'll earn you big money and take care of those pipes <laughs> all right again we're gonna do a brief overview just want to know how I'm right next to this diesel and I can talk that's the big Kubota interior four and we've got our heater it's integrated it's not an afterthought on the heating system. It's our Big Daddy diesel hot water. Full point of attack here. Nothing like it. Nothing like it out in this, not in the Jetter market. Beautiful rig, all these extra lighting. You can see that. Lighting on the bar, this full swivel. Might go ahead and show how this swivel works. Chris, so you got a pin on the side. So it's pinned in. How many bolts are holding this on, up underneath? <laughs> Look at that. It, it will not fall off like some of the others do. Look at all the bolts up in there. The back end of this is all reinforced. Right up underneath. 
you. So you got full side, side operational controls and rear lighting. So all your controls are mounted right here. Wow, that's beautiful. So you can go rear or side, plus you got the guide arm. Nobody's got that. Nice. If you're interested in a, a large jetter and you're shopping, I don't think anything even begins to compare with this unit that's on the market. Build to run. Give us a call. Happy to build one for you. Take care.